everyone. I wanted to do a video on my new bag that I have been using. This is a little sports sack and I have a little hand sanitizer on here from Bath and Body Works. It's my little cat one. I think I've showed it before, but I picked up a new one this evening. They had all their Christmas ones out, but this popcorn one stuck out to me. I love popcorn, so I got that one. <laughs> Um, but they have a really cute um, Christmas ones in right now. But this bag, I love, like, there's another brand that always had, like, tattoo-inspired bags. I don't know if that's what this is supposed to be, but it has, like, this little compass. I really loved that. And it has little keys, flowers, diamonds. There are little purses on here. This print really caught my eye. Another thing, reason I really want this bag, I have always loved these little birds. I don't know if they're sparrows, these little bluebirds or swallows. But anyway, it says love on their little banner. And I know this is on some of the tattoo print bags that I've seen in the past. There's a little heart lock and key right here, little cherries. So you can just see a little love letter. This print is just super cute to me. Um, there's little feathers and beads throughout. So this is really, I would say, the back of the bag. Um, but then this is the side I was using because I love the blue birds. But then on this side, there is a zip pocket. So I guess either way, but to me, when on the inside, I feel like the zip wall pocket's always on the side, of, like towards the back of the bag. So that's where the zip pocket is on the inside of this one. I'll show you that in just a minute. But where this one zips, this is where I've been putting my phone. And of course, I'm using it right now. Um, and then I have some coupons in there. This is the small hobo. Um, I know it's probably close to the older Clio bag that I don't think they have anymore. This is how it looks, just like that. It's a really good size. In this back section, I have my sunglasses, and that's all that I have in there. It has a really nice, comfortable, wide strap. It's not the real slick one, so it stays on my shoulder. I have a little bag. I purchased a ring at TJ Maxx. I love getting the rings out of the little jewelry section. They're usually about 20 or less, the ones that I buy anyway. Um, I have my bigger wallet in here. I was trying to move around so I could show you. I don't know if you can see. I don't think you can, but there is a open pocket right here you can see it move and then there's another open pocket then the zip pocket is all on that one wall the other wall has the two just open pockets and this is the inside I have all my stuff in there even with this big wallet and everything fits really nicely I think this bag, I can't remember if I got it on sale. I probably had a coupon. It might have been on sale and a coupon. I'm sure I did not pay for a price. But this is how it looks zipped. And you can definitely, where is a hobo, if you push down, it does have the little hobo down, as I call it. Um, I love how it looks. I've been shopping with it all day. It's been nice and comfortable. There are no feet on the bottom. It does have this reinforced line right here that they stitch. That really kind of keeps it, if you can see, it's not saggy bottom. It holds its shape on the bottom. And that's where they do that nice line of stitchings right there. And that is all I think I have to show about this bag. It only has the two outside pockets, but they're really nice roomy pockets. So this is the small hobo. Um, sorry, I do not know the name of this print, but it's on there and I do believe it's new. I just received this, I think last week, so it's definitely still on there. Thanks for watching. Bye.